everybody, it's Rory O'Malley from Broadway's Book of Mormon, and this is my first video blog for Broadway.com. I thought I'd start off with taking you all to the theater a little bit earlier than my usual half hour call, and seeing how we get ready for the show every day. So come on with me. Hey guys, so here I am before the show, usually drinking my usual venti. I need at least one venti per show. Thank you Starbucks for making me have a career possible. And uh, here is the show uh, line before we start. People are lining up right now. It's about an hour and a half before showtime, but we just had the lottery cleared out and um, people are getting excited to get inside. Of course, now they're excited to get inside for some air conditioning because it's so darn hot. Uh, but why don't I take you inside and you can meet some of the people who run this show. Hi, Broadway.com. Hi, John Eric. Broadway's John Eric Parker, everyone. Being filmed by Roy O'Malley. Now, Broadway's this Roy is what, what it, tell everybody what we do when we come in to work. This is a sign-in sheet. Yes. What we do is we initial, like, like so. And here's something that people don't know. This is my initials, J, E. Uppercase J, lowercase oh. E. That's how I sign in. Very interesting. Oh, and we're, I'm right above you. Yeah. Oh, wow. And that's I wonder why how that I'm happened. always looking up to you, Rory. Yes. Actually, I'm literally always looking up to you, John. Hi, Rory. Oh, okay. See, I'm always looking up to Thank you. Thank you. Hi, Rory. You're so sweet. Hi. Hi. I want to be you when I grow up. This is Dimitri. He works our door. He keeps us all safe here at the Book of Mormon. Uh, do you have any crazy stories about being here at the stage door? I don't know how many people know about Broadway, but the theaters have ghosts. Ooh. So, um, when I first started here, I was walking across the stage the other night. Out of the corner of my eye, I saw a fedora on a chair, like about eight rows in, like when I was crossing the stage. Right. That was, it was like my first week, and that was a few years ago. Anyway, someone filled in for me about four days ago, and um, came up to me, and they were like, Dimitri, can I ask you a question? And I was like, what? Like, have you ever seen any ghost here? And I was like, why? And he said he turned. He's like, I saw a shadowy figure with a fedora. Oh my god. And it disappeared. And, and I had forgotten about it because it was a few years ago. And he was like, Am I crazy? I was like, I don't know. Maybe we all are. Here we are checking the lights and the set, making sure everything is good to go and uh, in working order. Say hello. Hi. Uh, Virginia just has been with us in the, the Mormon family for a very long time, but she just got her own personal track as a uh, dresser to Elder, uh, excuse me, Elder Cunningham and Price. Yes. How's it going? It's going really well. We're ending the first week. Everything yes. went really smoothly. Of Keep course. Keeping my fingers crossed. Because you're so good at your job. Every, no matter what, she's done every single track in every this track. show. I uh, snuck the last one in right at the last minute, but I learned all of them. That's right. This is one of my favorites, so, so I'm glad I got this one. All right. Well, <laughs> we're really good. lucky to have you. Thanks. Here is uh, uh, backstage our calendars of house seats. And as you can see, there are a lot of red X's. Here is our stage management office. The, uh, the loge suite. And no one is in here. I have no idea why. I've rarely seen this office empty, but they got a nice setup here. They've got a... Uh... What are you doing in our office? Oh! Oh! <laughs> uh, there she is, our, our stage manager, Karen Moore. Extraordinaire, the captain of our ship. I'm cleaning coffee up. It's cleaning coffee. One of the major jobs of a production stage manager on Broadway is coffee duty. Some actors can do it. <laughs> Derek on our stage management team here Hi, is. Hi. Uh, he is going to show us the um, the preset, right? Yes. So the crew comes in an hour and a half before the show starts uh -huh. and resets the scenery and the props. Okay. And then about 45 minutes before the show starts, stage management comes down and just double checks everything. Cool. So here we are on stage left in the hallway. Here we are. Here's our prop shows. Lots of 
Book of Mormons. Yeah, we've got a typewriter, some backpacks, and a test, texting device. A texting device. A lightsabers. A baby. Baby, some texting innards. Uh, and this yeah. is the uh, licorice roots that Lawrence chews on during the chews show. on because he's a method actor. Yeah. And his character likes licorice roots. Yep. Yep. So. We don't have too much room out here, but we use all of the space. I don't we like have. them. They're disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> they don't even taste like licorice. They taste like roots. <laughs> here, there's backstage. There's backstage. We don't have a lot of room. We use back. every all of the space we have. We use. Here's the mission couch, and there's artillery boxes. some artillery for the warlord. <laughs> <laughs> here are the golden plates that I put uh, in the ground every night as Angel Moroni, and actually I'm putting them into this little pocket here that has a magnet. That it attaches falls. and falls underneath. It attaches and falls underneath, and I have missed it before, and it is <laughs> not pretty. And then the plates are just sitting on the ground. Here, stage right. Stage right. You can see the donkey. Oh, I got a flashlight. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, this looks really creepy with your flashlight. <laughs> a donkey <laughs> upside down. It looks like a total horror film. Yeah. The Book of Mormon <laughs> horror films. And here we got beds. Beds. Everything has to go up in the air yeah. because there's no room backstage. I mean, if you look, this is all the room we have. Yeah. Like three feet. Here's the fly rail all the way up. Wow. Very cool. I'm looking at it like I've never seen it before, but... <laughs> And there's the now grass. With a flat. Whoa, the I've never seen that. The Tower of Grass. Wow. Yeah. Wow. We stack them up. I've done this show over 500 times and I've never seen the forest that's above <laughs> my head. That's so cool. Here are our backstage screens. This is a camera that is put on our conductor, Stephen Oremus. So when people are singing backstage, they can follow along with the music. And then we have another screen here that shows what's going on on stage. And there's our beautiful drop that opens the show. That same Malachi's across the street. At half hour, they play There's No Business Like Show Business. That's not really exactly what my Catholic church did growing up, but we are on Broadway. All right, well, that song over at St. Malachi's means that I have to get ready for the show. It's half hour, but I will see you guys next week. Let me know if you have any questions for me or anyone else in the cast. Just send them my way on Twitter at Rory O'Malley. See you guys.